Hi friends, welcome to today's class. So today's question is A and B can do a work in 15 days, B and C in 20 days, C and A in 12 days. In how many days can they complete it if they work together and if they work separately? So what is the given question? So A and B when working together can complete a work in 15 days. B and C when working together can complete the same work in 20 days. And C and A when working together can complete the same work in 12 days. So if A, B and C are working together, how many days will they take to complete the work? And if A is working separately, how much time will A take to complete the work? And how much time will B take to complete the work? And how much time will C take to complete the work? So this is the given question. We are using the chocolate approach. So the number of chocolates will be equal to the LCM of 15, 12 and 20. So it will be equal to 60. The lowest common multiple of 15, 20 and 12 is equal to 60. The total amount of work to be done, we are assuming it as the number of chocolates to be consumed which is equal to the LCM of 15, 20 and 12 is equal to 60. So how much time will A and B take? A and B is taking 15 days. So they will be having 60 by 15 is equal to 4 chocolates per day. Then what about B and C? B and C are taking 20 days to complete the work. So they will be having 60 by 20 is equal to 3 chocolates per day. C and A are taking 12 days to complete the work. So they will be having 60 by 12 is equal to 5 chocolates per day. So when we are adding these 3, we will be getting 2A plus 2B plus 2C is having 4 plus 3 is 7, 7 plus 5 is equal to 12 chocolates per day. So from that we will be getting 2 into A plus B plus C will be equal to 6, 12 chocolates per day. Therefore we will be getting A plus B plus C will be having 6 chocolates per day. Dividing 12 by 2 will be getting 6. So when A, B and C are eating chocolates together, they will be having 6 chocolates per day. So now we can complete the first part of the question. If they work together, how much time will they take? The number of chocolates is equal to 60 and A, B and C together are having 6 chocolates per day. Therefore, we will be getting number of days is equal to 60 divided by 6 is equal to 10 days. Now let's go to the second part of the question. So how many days will be taken if A is doing the work separately, B is doing the work separately and C is doing the work separately. For that we have to find out how many chocolates are cons consumed by A in one day, how many chocolates are consumed by B in one day and as well as C in one day. For, that, for, for finding it out we can substitute A plus B in this equation so we will be getting A plus B is equal to 4. So 4 plus C is equal to 6. From that we will be getting C is equal to 2 chocolates per day. So C will be consuming 2 chocolates per day. Then if you are substituting B plus C is equal to 3 in this equation we will be having A plus 3 is equal to 6. So A is equal to 3 chocolates per day. So A, B and C together are having 6 chocolates per day. B and C together are having 3 chocolates per day. So from that we will be getting A is having 3 chocolates per day. And then last C plus A is equal to 5 chocolates. So C and A together will be having 5 chocolates per day. A, B and C together is having 6 chocolates per day. So from that we will be getting B will be having 1 chocolate per day. So from this we can find out how many days will be taken if A is working separately, B is working separately and C is working separately. So A will be having 3 chocolates per day and the total number of chocolates is 60. So when A is working separately, A will be taking 60, 60 chocolates divided by 3 chocolates per day. So A will be taking 20 days if A is working alone. And what about B? B is having 1 chocolate per day. So 60 chocolates divided by 1 chocolate per day. So B will be taking 60 days to complete the work. And what about C? C is having 2 chocolates per day. So total number of chocolates is 60. 60 divided by 2 is equal to 30 days. So C will be taking 30 days when working separately. So the first part of the question is when A, B and C are working together, they will be taking 10 days. And when A is working alone, he will be taking 20 days. When B is working alone, he will be taking 60 days. And when C is working alone, he will be taking 30 days. Thank you for watching.